International Day of Parliamentarism is celebrated every year on the 30th of June. The day was established in 2018 through a United Nations General Assembly resolution. Celebrating an International Day for Parliamentarians and Parliament is a unique opportunity for organizations like the Commonwealth Parliamentary Association, the CPA. With our membership of over 17,000 parliamentarians spread across 180 legislatures, we must use this opportunity to take stock of the importance of parliamentary democracy and its value to our societies and our global communities. I would like to use this important day to focus on adaption and diversity. Adaption was a key theme for our recent Commonwealth Parliamentary Conference held in Uganda in September last year. At that time, over 500 parliamentarians were able to come together to share ideas, build networks, and learn from one another. But now the Commonwealth is facing one of its greatest challenges in tackling the COVID-19 global pandemic. Parliamentarians are now focusing their minds on creating safe and secure environments for their countries and constituencies. To succeed in this endeavor, parliamentarians and parliaments have had to embrace rapid and uncertain change in the form of technical, social, and cultural adaption. From how to communicate and travel to the ways in which we legislate, represent, and scrutinize governments. As such, adapting to new ways of working is essential. We are to be adaptive, innovative, and have all tools needed to overcome the challenges we face today and in the future. We must have a diversity of voices and people sharing ideas, building networks, and learning from one another. When one voice is stifled, we are all weakened. Recently, I have been struck by the Black Lives Matter movement that was started in the United States and that has now spread across the globe. A movement that at its heart is about tackling racism and division. What this has reinforced in me is that nobody should be left behind. Nobody should be silenced because of the color of their skin, their gender, age, ethnicity, religion, language, culture, sexuality, or ability. These values are at the heart of what the Commonwealth stands for. This was reflected in this year's Commonwealth Day theme, delivering a common future, connecting, innovating, transforming. The message is clear. Together we are stronger, and together we can overcome our greatest challenges. Within the CPA, we champion these principles in enabling women and disabled parliamentarians to work collaboratively through the Commonwealth Women Parliamentarians and Commonwealth Parliamentarians with Disability Networks, as well as those from small jurisdiction via the CPA Small Branches Network. As parliamentarians, we are the representatives of our communities, and as such, we must speak for all those who might be at a potential disadvantage because of their perceived differences and the negative prejudice of others. Even if we as representatives are not reflective of the diversity of our people, we must as parliamentarians still speak for all and ensure their views, ideas, and knowledge can be voiced in the chambers of our parliament, in the meeting rooms of government departments, or on the streets of our constituencies. In my view, that is what being a parliamentarian is worth for and why we should use this day not to celebrate ourselves, but to remind us of what our duties are as parliamentarians and to those we serve. Thank you very much.